I actually filmed Ab's video yesterday, but I feel like I didn't do it enough justice, so I'm gonna refilm it today. Uh, this video is gonna be if I've started training abs again today, literally, how I would go about it, all right? We are gonna do three exercises. I would choose three exercises that I could decide on the difficulty myself, no matter where I am, okay? So even if I'm home, even if I'm at the gym, I can still do the very same exercise. Even if I'm at a hotel, you know, it doesn't matter. All right, so three exercises, and let's start with the first one. So exercise number one, crunches. I will literally do crunches, okay? Now exercise number two. So this is number two, leg raises, and number three now, Air cycling or whatever you want to call it, knee to elbow, whatever, I don't care, okay? This is the third exercise. So, now let's talk sets, reps, rest, okay? Crunches first, number one, okay? Three sets, body weight, nothing else, until failure. What do I mean by failure is that you do not stop when it's burning, you do stop when it starts like cramping, okay? This is failure. Not when it burns. After it burns, you continue doing it, okay? So, for crunches, this is what we do. Three sets, and your rest time in between will be minimal, okay? Because your abs, you will see that they recover really fast, and also we are trying to exhaust them, okay? So, uh, about like one minute, two minutes tops. Like two minutes is like absolute tops, okay? Like normally, if I do it myself, I would probably go for like 30 seconds, maybe 45 seconds, right? So, you can slowly decrease that. You can start off with like, for example, two minutes and then eventually, like gradually, you can go like, for example, the week after, you can drop it by like another 15 seconds or so on to increase the intensity. Number two, leg raises. Same thing, you go until failure, body weight, you don't need to do anything else. You'll most likely be able to do like maybe 20, 30 reps anyways, if you do it properly, controlled movement, okay? I really want you to do controlled movement when you're doing leg raises. So you've seen how I did it. This is not slow, this is not speed up. Like this is the kind of movement speed that I want. Like very slow, all controlled, all the way through, okay? The legs never touch the ground. And also when you go up, you never go 90 degrees, okay? You go like 85-ish and then come back. And it's all controlled, okay? You feel the weight of your legs constantly on your abs when you're doing it, all right? And number three, cycling. Only two sets for this one. For leg raises, same as well. Like try to rest for like, you know, one to two minutes in between sets, three sets. So for cycling, the last exercise, do only two sets, same, until failure, until it burns, okay? Like, until it burns and you continue burning it, until you cannot just tolerate the pain anymore, all right? And this is how you do it, all right? So literally, I would do this. Now let's say you're like, oh, but you know, I'm not super strong and I don't feel it and it takes like too long. Okay, no worries. What do you do with your crunches, right? So I'm just gonna show you an example. Just get my water bottle, okay? Just an example, you can literally do it with anything. Just get books, you know, whatever you can find, like heavy, all right? Even a water bottle. Hold it here, ready? Now it's not body weight anymore, you're actually lifting some weight, okay, with your crunches. Same goes for your leg raises, right? For cycling you would never need it, trust me. So you get it, water bottle, whatever, I don't care. If you hold it in between your knees, it is not gonna weigh as much. If you wanna make it even farther, you hold it in between your feet, okay? So, the same weight, if you hold it in between your knees, 
it's not gonna feel as heavy, but if you hold it far away from your hand, from the center basically, center of moment, it's gonna feel heavier. And then you do the same thing. And trust me, when you get like, you know, uh, five pounds, 10 pounds of weight like this, it's gonna really burn and you're really gonna feel it, okay? You've seen how the exercises work. I just told you how many sets, how many reps you go about these. Uh, in terms of frequency, I would recommend like two times a week, okay? So you do this app session twice a week. So maybe you do it on like once on Monday, once on Friday, or I, I don't care, okay? You just decide when you wanna do it. Just don't do it like, uh, within a day apart, okay? So if you're doing it on like Wednesday, don't go and do it on Thursday again, okay? Give it more time for recovery. So I would suggest like give at least like two days for recovery. And eventually you can increase the frequency by the way. So if you wanna do it, for example, like three times a week, that's also completely fine. Four times a week, that's also completely fine. You're most likely not gonna need to do it like that crazy, okay? So trust me, just do these. You're gonna develop very, very good apps. Okay, just be patient, be consistent, and do it as I said, okay? You don't need to watch these like stupid videos where people, you know, do like weird exercises and you know, they talk about like weird stuff. Uh, first of all, if you haven't watched my abs video, go and watch this one, okay? So that's it with the abs training. Trust me, do these three exercises, okay? And you can do it for a long, long time. And by the time you actually like got sick of them, you're gonna have very well developed apps, all right? So it's just simple as that, like you don't have to do anything crazy. People do complicate things a lot just to get some views or clicks and stuff like that. Like do not believe any of them. Like you don't have to do like a bunch of weird exercises, you know, that looks ridiculous. Like you don't have to do like one arm jump jacks with your, you know, one thumb in your like, I mean, come on, all right? Just do these simple exercises and I promise you, you're gonna develop very, very, very good abs, okay? So that's pretty much it for this video. I think I explained it pretty clearly. So, you're welcome. <laughs> like, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff. Share it with your friends who wanna develop abs as well. And I'm gonna see you guys on the next one.